Всем привет! I'm glad to see you today on my channel. Today I want to show you our home, our temporary new home that we are renting now here in Georgia. It's a very beautiful place in the countryside, it's a house. But uh, before we go inside, I want to talk a little bit about why we decided to rent a house because we've been living in apartments our whole life. I've been talking about that in my previous apartment tours. So we've rented the house and let's talk about why. I have cute roses here. <laughs> we analyzed uh, the season in life that we are in now and we decided we will look for a place for this summer autumn season specifically for a place that we can afford but that would have more sleeping areas in august i'm going to give birth and there are a lot of relatives who plan to come and we need a lot of places to host them there is my mom coming Torla's mom coming Torla's brother's wife coming uh, my dad is going to come in june uh, we've been hosting friends for a month and we needed two separate rooms for them and there also one more family of our friends are planning to come for the vacation so we need a lot of sleeping places for uh, our friends and relatives in this season and we've decided that it will be a house 100 not an apartment because it's hard to host people in apartment and because it makes no sense to rent an apartment with so many sleeping areas and it's too expensive and we've been looking for a house specifically in the countryside far from the city uh, because we wanted to have a very nice uh, air territory for Agatha to play in nature we really wanted to have that experience for her and she's been feeling much better here she's been eating well sleeping well so we've been looking for a house in the countryside also because it's cheaper than in the city like renting something in the city like a house is just <laughs> insane <laughs> so yeah let's go inside and you'll see that this place is perfect for the needs that we've been kind of looking for so for sleeping areas and for Agatha to play in nature and also I'm in that countryside mode uh, waiting for the harvest season because we have apples and apricots and a lot of other stuff growing here let's go sorry guys i will not show you the outside territory much but it's beautiful here <laughs> anyway here is the entry territory there is like a place for shoes and a little bit of clothes we need to put some hangers here uh, for coats and uh, jackets place for random stuff that is usually like accumulating here <laughs> we have a beautiful banana bag uh, that is mine and a beautiful uh, flower bag that is Agatha's very important things here there is that door and also another door these are just like small closet rooms but they are full with um, landlord belongings so we don't use them they're just closed <laughs> so let's go here and here is the kitchen living room area let's like walk around <laughs> here we don't use even half of it <laughs> it's very big and it's also full of landlord dishes and we can use them there are just so many of them uh, she has been using this house as a summer house house for like celebrating birthdays and things like that and that's why she has like very many dishes <laughs> here for all the people that she has been hosting here and we use just some of these cupboards but still we use most of her dishes we have a little bit of ours here but just a little bit and we have a dishwasher guys here it's been saving my life i've never had a dishwasher before but if we will one day have our own place that we'll buy like a house we will have a dishwasher because it's just life savior and we also use this place as a place for books and a little bit of Agatha's crafts and Agatha's books because we just don't have any other place to put them. Uh, I love uh, that system here in Georgia and in Russia it's the same that houses and apartments go fully furnished uh, for rent 
and you don't have to buy literally anything very often there are even dishes and like you don't have to buy any furniture i know in many countries you have to buy your own furniture for the apartment sometimes even your kitchen and the fact that we don't own almost anything here except for our very personal belongings like clothes and books makes moving from like place to place very easy and it actually makes us you know not to have to buy so much stuff and not to have to buy big expensive things like furniture so yeah i like that system very much here's a cute table and a sofa and here is uh the red house that actually looks very similar to this house so it's like a tiny house inside the big house it's like very cute yeah we brought our reds here um, with us from russia it was complicated and not very legal experience but <laughs> we will not talk about that here <laughs> here is a little bit of a mess with agatha's toys uh, we have all her toys here, we had to bring all of them from Russia and we don't have a shelf for them yet, but we'll put them somewhere here and they're just in the box, so temporary looking stuff and uh, this is the TV that we've never turned on, but I think it's working so this is the fireplace and my husband is burying wood here almost every single evening so we have a little bit of papers here too and a little bit dim uh, area and hand-picked flowers that my husband kindly brought me last time he was he went grocery shopping let's go to the second floor there are stairs very dangerous stairs for little kids so here is a little territory here's a window beautiful window uh, in the garden there's a balcony door that will open later because it's hard to open it <laughs> and here's the bathroom and the sleeping area so let's go to the bathroom now this is the bathroom and I love the window in the bathroom so much I'm such a fan of windows in bathrooms we obviously close it uh, when we're taking a shower but most of the time during the day it's open and I just love the natural light here we have a shower here only uh, no bath and honestly guys I miss having a bath so much my husband and I we are huge like bath lovers <laughs> so yeah we really miss our bath but the shower works nice too we actually don't have to pay for water here because the water goes from the well and the pump so free water kind of <laughs> we have a washing machine uh, also here i know it's not common to have a washing machine in the bathroom in all the countries and we have all of our bath supplies uh, stored here like we we don't have much bath things like toothpaste and shower gel agatha decided to wake up from her day nap and join us this is all the sleeping area this is like the little living room area there is a couch and a fake fireplace <laughs> and a little bit of cute stuff that i've organized here so we don't do much things in this place like there's pretty much nothing to do here i think maybe we'll do something like um area for agatha's like crafts and things like that but we'll see like now it's just mostly we, we don't use it much here is a cute little uh, cube with our photos that my mom gifted to us there are a lot of very cute pictures and these are three small bedrooms uh, so let's start with the first one yeah, that's good. <laughs> this is the first bedroom small cute bedroom there are just blankets now we i didn't put any bed sheets on it because it's empty and it's waiting for our relatives and friends so this is the first little space we don't use it now let's go to the second one this is a dark one i like it a little bit more it's more empty looking there is just a bed and the wardrobe and it's also waiting for our friends and family i don't like that it's dark but i like uh, the blue like wallpapers i think the, the color is really beautiful and this is our bedroom at the moment you probably can tell i choose it for two windows <laughs> it's the only bedroom that has two windows it's quite small 
um, but I really like a lot of uh, natural light uh, coming here and Agatha was sleeping here so it's a little bit a mess here. Here is Agatha's wardrobe full of her clothes and a little bit of her books that we read. You can tell I was cleaning here <laughs> and organizing things before showing you. Usually it's a little bit more messy here. We also don't have much space here for Agatha's bed, uh, like Agatha's side bed. So uh, we are thinking maybe changing this room for the blue one. Maybe we'll move to the blue room and there's a little bit more space for the bed. Um, but maybe we'll do something with the third floor, we'll see. This is our wardrobe, uh, all of our clothes are here and uh, a little bit uh, more clothes like jackets and my husband's hoodies are in big wardrobe in that um, like another bedroom, but most of our clothes are just here. Audrey Hepburn, all papers. <laughs> Not a big fan of them, but like, whatever. <laughs> so here are all the sleeping places here. It's perfect for our needs for this summer autumn season. And we really have been looking for a place like that. We have been really blessed with this house. I don't want to buy any like furniture here or anything expensive. I don't want to do any renovations or like anything because uh, I don't think we'll stay here for a very long time. Uh, I mean, we've been looking for a house for this season of hosting people. And for our family only, we need uh, just much smaller space. <laughs> for now, it's working perfectly. We have an agreement for a year. I don't know if, if it will work that uh, well in uh, winter and in spring, but at least till the end of autumn, I think we'll be enjoying this place very much. I can't wait for all of our relatives and friends to come and enjoy this harvest season with us and like I love hosting people preparing all the like towels and pillows for them. <laughs> you know like there is a minimalist side of me that wants uh, a small like perfect looking space for just our family and then there is another part of me that loves you know organizing family dinners and with friends, like some events and host everybody and call friends and say, hey, hi, come over and stay overnight. So yeah, there are just two parts of me that are like trying to live together. <laughs> Let's go to the first third floor. Uh, there are not much stuff there, but it's the most beautiful place here. So let's go there. floor and there is not much things here because it's very hot during the day because of the windows but it's so beautiful here and I love this loft kind of style here that uh, we can make <laughs> but I don't know what to do with the heat uh, if you have any ideas you can write them down but like opening windows doesn't help it's just like a like a like banya, if, if you know what banya is. <laughs> but I'd love to make like an extra bedroom here because we still need one extra place for um, the August when all of our relatives will come. And I would actually love to make it the place for us because it's so beautiful, but like the, the heating here is just kind of intense. <laughs> so yeah, there are not much things, but I'm thinking if we will solve this uh, heat problem, we'll make something like a extra sleeping area here, maybe a place for work, because I need a place for filming and working, like a little studio. But this is my favorite part of the house where we spend just the tiniest amount of time because there's nothing to do here. But Agatha loves to uh, play on this mattress that is just laying down on the floor. <laughs> we forgot to show you the balcony. I've asked Toilet to open the door because there's just a little bit of troubles of opening it. <laughs> so this is the balcony. We didn't clean it yet. <laughs> uh, it's very messy here and there is uh, the hanger for clothes after laundry. It's a very beautiful view here and I want to clean it and organize a little bit of a working uh, area for myself because there is a cute table with a chair and there is also a place for electricity so I think it will be very nice 
working with the laptop and just enjoying the sun so thank you guys a lot for watching i loved having you over for the house tour uh, i loved showing you all the rooms and i think i would love to work as a real estate agent and just film all the properties <laughs> i love house tours and apartment tours that's just one of my favorite types of videos thank you a lot for watching i hope you enjoyed staying with us for this little time and see you in my next video bye bye